Hello everybody, Danielle here, and today you can find me at the Santi Alley, also known as Los Callejones or the Fashion District in downtown Los Angeles. We're gonna go ahead and walk through and see what we find today, so come on, let's go. So living in Los Angeles, the Santi Alley has been a place that you come to on the weekend. Um, you try to find some cool stuff for a good price. You can find a lot of merchandise and stuff, so let's go ahead and check it out. I have some Nike tracksuits here as well. I wonder how much they cost. And then also to ooh, see, so you can find some Louis Vuitton stuff, some Prada. They also have a lot of Mario stuff as well. Supreme. Ooh. And you know, obviously not real, but you can find some pretty good knockoffs here. Um, you just gotta take a look at the quality because some of them look really bad and some of them look pretty decent. So you just gotta check it out and see what you find. You can also come here to buy some suitcases for a pretty good price because you know that can add up. And then if you're going to a rave, this is definitely a place that you want to come to go ahead and buy some cute little outfits. You see? So as I mentioned, you can always see that we're in LA. By walking through these alleys, you can see some Raiders gear, some Dodgers gear. They also have some Cowboys, some Nike stuff as well. Here you go, sweats for $10. So definitely if you're here looking for some graphic stuff, you can see even here they have like a little Playboy thing which I know is really popular now. They have a lot of wrappers as well too and you can find them for a pretty good price. Look, they have socks, 24 pairs for $12. They even have a little Wednesday shirt. Some Hello Kitty. See, so you can even see they have jeans here for $10. I mean, I'm not sure what brand this is. I've never heard of it. But hey, if you're looking for something cheap, it's always good to come here and find it. Also here, what they have is a lot of Hello Kitty stuff, which I know is super popular, super cute. So you can find some of that. Look, they even have something with Carol G. Oh. They even have these little um, Disney mini balls right here too that you can find in Target. Those are really popular. They have some Super Mario stuff. So a lot of like kids toys and stuff like that. I'm sure a lot of people come here because they try to get something for cheap. Um, definitely like a mark off um, certain type of stuff of like name brand stuff that you see um, but let's see what else we find I notice they also have a lot of cute sunglasses here usually that you can find like some cute little hats Ooh, Louis Vuitton you can also come here and find like a lot of dress Stuff. like if you're going to like an event or a wedding um, you see they have like men's shoes here they also have like button-down shirts um, and sweaters a lot of shoes here as you can tell Ooh, so look at this this is my favorite stuff to see here so they have clothing with some cool stuff on it as you can see some bad bunny gear and I love bad bunny I mean who doesn't Oh, they even have a cute little Carol G shirt. 
And they have like a lot of merchandise. You see like some Nirvana and stuff. So in downtown here, you can also find a lot of hats. So as you see here, they have a lot of different hats. I know in some other stores, I think on the inside, they have like a lot of LA hats. You can find a lot of LA gear here. I mean, and as you're walking through, you can see a lot of Los Angeles merch and you definitely know that you're in Los Angeles. A lot of kids games. They also, as I mentioned, they do sell stuff like if you're going to a wedding or a certain event, they have like ladies heels and stuff. I know you can find a lot of good prices for that. You can find a lot of cute um, little just cheap t-shirts that ever everyday wear. Like look at this, like a cute crop top, $3.99. They also have like some cute bodysuits over there as well. A lot of cute women's clothing that you can find for pretty cheap as well. Again, some sunglasses. I'm actually going to have to go and try some on too because I need some sunglasses too. So we'll see what we find. So women's clothing. There's also a lot of really cheap makeup that you can find here. Okay, let me show you guys. So lashes, lots of lashes over here. They also have like some straighteners, you can see right here. Are you doing the YouTube video? Yeah. As, as, and as you can see, there's so many people here. It's Sunday right now. This is like a good family place for people to come, spend some time. There's a lot of food here as well, um, you know, and great deals that you can find as well. So it's usually always a good time. They also have like some colored contacts and like I said, lots of makeup too. You can even find like some Anastasia or Kylie um, cosmetics um, dupes here as well. I'm not sure how the quality is, but you can check it out. And also, a lot of really cute girls clothes I think these are bikinis but oh my god if you see them they're super cute look at this one oh my god that's cute a lot of like really cute women's clothing also find a lot of um, knockoff perfumes as well for really good prices they have here in there. To be honest, I bought one one time because um, it was at a really good price. And then I took it home and then I was wearing it and I didn't end up liking how it smelled. And then after that, I smelled the same one, you know, the real one at a different location smell anything like it so you gotta be really careful when you're buying those <laughs> jewelry here too as well
children's clothing. Like I mentioned, they have a lot of clothes, a lot of stories with like the graphic tees and stuff. So pretty much when you come here, there's something for everybody. There's something for the kids. There's ladies clothing, men's clothing. I just saw some dresses for older women as well. There's wigs, there's makeup, there's jewelry. You can find a little bit of everything. Some snacks. Everybody loves snacks, right? They have some cool suits for men. Wow, very eccentric. Something different, huh? They're trying to come in with style. They have some cute little graphic tees. Let me show you guys. I think it's for kids here. You guys can check them out. Little Chucky! <laughs> Oh, they have some cause figures here. Woo! Those are super cool. What are we recording, man? Do you guys know what cause are? I love cause, but they're super expensive. Oh, and this is like a rave store. It's actually a really famous rave store here in um, Los Angeles that sells like a lot of merchandise. It's called Raveland. Actually, not a raver here, but. Definitely could come check out this place if you want something. And I also noticed they have a lot of like spiritual stores that sell like crystals and sage. Hello, how are you doing? You see like a lot of Dodgers gear, sports gear here. And again, so many stores with the women's clothing here. So like I said, you're gonna know you're in California when you're here. Just some Los Angeles stuff. So in case, in case you're coming to visit Los Angeles and you stop by, you want some souvenirs for cheap, you can definitely stop by here and pick something up. This store called Pink Glam Box which I know is pretty popular. They have it decorated super cute and aesthetic in there. And they have a lot of different makeup as you can see. So let's just take a look. Maybe some lashes. So I mentioned if you want like some really cute um, graphic jackets from Selena. Nipsey Hustle as well. And definitely they sell lots of different Mexican food here um, because we are in Los Angeles hello so they have some esquite with hot Cheetos some nacho cheese on there some various drinks lots of fruit you can purchase here as well. That made me hungry actually. I'm gonna have to stop and get one as well. So the thing is that you will find some fake market items, you know, Louis Vuitton, Gucci, stuff like that here, but not as much as you could find some before. So actually when I was younger, they would have stores that would just have a lot of merchandise, you know, a lot of purses and hats and everything out. But I feel like now it's a lot more hidden because I think probably the law has cracked down on that or something because you really don't see it. Sometimes I will see somebody sitting there, you know, just holding one with a bag and you'll say, oh, come follow me to the back. I have lots of pur purses. So it's definitely something really taboo here um, and they crack down on it a lot. So if you're trying to find something, it's a little bit more difficult, but you will see a few items. 
All right, so I've reached the end of the alley now. So I'm gonna go ahead and let you guys know so I can get myself a cool little treat. It's been a pleasure. If you guys like this video, go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Give this video a like, go ahead and share it. And we'll see you on the next one. Bye.